Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Couponing with Kayla. So if you're new here, don't forget to take a second to hit that red subscribe button below so you don't miss any of my new videos. So we are about to go into Walmart. We haven't been to Walmart since like March, so it's been a long time, but we gotta pick up some groceries and also I'm gonna do some I bought a rebate. So some of you guys may have gotten that weekly essentials bonus. Now it can vary by account on I bought a, so mine is due 24 offers and get $5. So I'm at least going to do half of those offers today because there's several things I'm going to pick up, but it'll at least help you get started. And if yours is like 10 offers and get a $5 bonus, then you'll be set because I've got several offers that we're going to look at here in the store and pair them up with some coupons as well. So let's go ahead and check out these deals. Wait, what? Okay guys, so the first item we're picking up is these Alka-Seltzer gum. So we got these $2 coupons and these 628 Smart Source, and that'll leave us paying $2.24 for these, but get back $2 on Ibotta, making the final cost for them just $0.24, cents, so super, super cheap. Next, we've got the Stay Free Feminine Care for $2.68. So we've got these $2 coupons. You can go on the Stay Free website and print out one of those. It's $2 off two. So if you pick up two of these, your total is gonna be $5.36. After using that $2 coupon, you're gonna pay $3.36, but get back a dollar for each on Ibotta, making your final cost just $1.36 for both of these. So I thought that these little carefree uh, breathe for 97 cents qualified for Ibotta, but they don't, so don't get those. The next item we're picking up are these Big Soleil razors. You want to pick up this pack here that is $3.27. This is like the cheapest one. And go on to the Big website and you can print this $3 coupon. Go to Big Razors, click on Women's, and then it'll show the coupon offers. So we're going to pay $0.27, cent, then also get back $3 on Ibotta. I did scan it. It does qualify. So this one is going to be a hot money maker. So always check the clearance at your store. These are really good pencils and they're on clearance for just a dollar and there's a ton of them here at my store. So we've got the Suave Lotion. We don't have a coupon for this. The coupon did expire, but it's $1.67. Get a dollar back when I bought it, paying just 67 cents for your final cost. Definitely check the girls' clothes clearance at your store. These are marked for $3 on clearance. I scanned it with my um, Walmart app, and they're actually ringing up $2, so even cheaper if you need some back-to-school clothes. So next, we're using this $1.50 coupon off of coupons.com on the Bella Dog Food. They're only $0.62 cents each, so if we pick up four of these, our total is $2.48. Use the $1.50 coupon. That'll leave us paying $0.98, cents, and I bought us giving back $0.50. Cents. So these are actually going to have a final cost of just $0.48 cents for all four, and Axel is going to organize them here in the cart for us. So the next one we're picking up are some Gain Flings for free. So they're way up there, so I grabbed one down. We're using this $2 coupon from the July PNG. So we're gonna pay $2.94, or no, $1.94, get back $2 on Ibotta, and that makes this completely free and a six cent money maker. So you can't beat that for some Gain Flings. So next, if you prefer the Tide Pods, they are priced at $4.94 um, here, and we have a $2 coupon from the July PNG. So I'm gonna grab one of these. So we'll pay $2.94 here in the store, but get back $2 on Ibotta. So that's gonna make the final cost for one bag of these, just 94 cents. And if you don't have the July PNG, definitely check on the PNG site for maybe some printable coupons. So these Snuggle Renewsits are priced for just $2.97 for this starter kit. And Ibotta is giving us back $2. So that's going to make your final cost just $0.97 cents for one of these and no coupons needed. So this is an Ibotta rebate that I get pretty often. So Axel's going to grab these for us. We're going to get one of the Sunbelt for $1.87. We have a $0.50 cent rebate. We're not getting those ones. Um, so we are going to pay a final cost of $1.37 for one box of these. And I'm also doing some of my grocery shopping while we're in here. <laughs> Giant cheese! <laughs> 
so I'm not grabbing these today and I'm not sure the exact price it doesn't say here but I think they're around eight something and I bought it as giving back a dollar fifty rebate so if you like these you could definitely incorporate that into your deals so next I'm gonna go ahead and pick up Pringles they're 148 get back 15 cents on I bought it making them just a dollar 33 so I'm not grabbing these little old Wisconsin um, turkey sticks, but I believe there's an I bought a rebate for that as well. So if you want those, definitely check it out. Two of the meals I was planning this week was beef stew and tacos. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up some clearance meat. And this is definitely going to help me on my groceries. So these little Intamin minis are $3.28. We have a dollar rebate on Ibotta. There's lots of different ones to choose from. So you can go ahead and grab one of these. Your final cost will be just $2.28. So these Chips Ahoy, they say $2.32, but um, they say more online. So I think they're more, but we do have an Ibotta rebate for this for a dollar. So I'm going to go ahead and grab these. Try at your own risk. <laughs> I was looking for a rebate that was going to be a freebie um, called brown cow yogurt or something like that, but I couldn't find it here at my store. So if you can find it, you purchase it and then it's free after the rebate. So we've got Jello here for $1.82. I went ahead and put one in my cart. So we're getting back 75 cent on Ibotta. So it'll make it just $1.07 for one of these. So this wasn't an item I was going to pick up, but these Z-Bars are $3.22 and there's a $0.75 cent rebate on Ibotta. So I'm going to get them for the kids to try for just $2.47 while I'm over here getting some Cliff Bars for my husband anyways. Remember to always stop by the free Osk in Walmart and you can pick up an easy little freebie. Well, this one is like some little sample. gummy vitamins. So yeah, stress relief. <laughs> So if you want to rack up your rebates and also grab something that you can eat, you can go ahead and get the Orata fries or $2.62 with a dollar rebate, making the final cost just $1.62, and I'll probably include that in a dinner meal this week. I stopped by a clearance cart here. This one is not marked at all, but they're ringing up a dollar. So I'm about to pay, and I'll go over my receipts with you in just a second. Okay guys, so we just got done at Walmart. That took longer than expected. There was a couple of rebates I was looking for that they didn't have, all of that. Axel got some mystery cars and all the coupons scanned just fine. The only one that I had trouble with was that one for the Bella dog food. For some reason it wouldn't scan even though I had four of the 3.5 ounce um, little dog foods. So the cashier, he just looked at it. I was at the self checkout. He walked over there. He looked at it, um, saw that I was buying the correct items and he just manually typed it in. Otherwise, everything else went good. I went ahead and submitted my receipt. It picked up all my rebates, so I'm happy about that. So we're gonna go over the receipt and everything here in just a minute. Okay guys, so you can see all my offers here on Ibotta. So I scanned my receipt as soon as I got in the car. Luckily, it did match up with all my offers. Didn't give me any trouble or anything. And I also got those offers for any brand, you know, laundry soap. And also it says any brand tampons. I didn't buy tampons, but I guess it did that for the other feminine care products I bought. So you can see all the rebates here. So I got back $20.15 and we're going to go over those, um, yeah, go over those receipts now. <laughs> Okay guys, so I am back home and this is my Ibotta haul. So today is July 12th. Um, so I picked up all these offers. I tried to get offers that I um, saw that were good on Ibotta for at least a few more days or longer. So some of these didn't even say when they were good till. So some of them will probably last a while. A few of them were like three more days, things like that. So I picked up everything that I went in, plan on, went in planning on getting except for a couple of things. And also um, I picked up a couple of things that I wasn't planning on. But I wanted to try to do a lot um, of the offers because I got that uh, weekly essentials bonus. And mine says $5 when you spend, um, or I mean, sorry, $5 when you purchase at least 24 offers. So just with this one alone, um, I matched 20 offers. Now, two of those were the any offers. So it gave me um, an offer for feminine care uh, for 10 cents. It gave me an offer of um, maybe lotion for 10 cents. It was something, I can't remember exactly. But anyway, so those two offers don't count towards the I bought a bonus. So that means that I did 18 offers 
So I'm still really close um, to that 24 offer mark and I have all the way until next Monday, I think it is. So I will definitely go ahead and do a few more offers um, this week and everything. And if some of these offers reset, I may even grab them again, like offers like this that are kind of come out like free. So let's just go ahead and take a look at everything. So my total for all the items that you see here, I even grabbed the Sprite on the way um, to the checkout because they're giving back 30 cents on this. So I figured why not? I'm thirsty and it gives me an extra offer. So um, all of this was $47.78 before any tax. So, um, and before any coupons. So anyways, I'm gonna show you my receipt here. Um, so if you look here, you can see the fries, the Jell-O, Sprite, uh, the chips, um, let's see here. This one is those Sour Patch Kid cookies. There's the Z-Bar, um, the snack pies, the Bella dog food. These right here are the Stay Free, um, the Gain, the Tide, the Snuggle um, Renews It, and the Lotion and the Big Razor. So all of that, um, oh, well, apparently I've got this all bent up. Let me see here. Sorry. Okay. And then also um, that gum, the Alka-Seltzer gum. So anyway, so my total there after coupons, you can see that all the coupons came off. Like I said, he did have to manually enter the one for the Bella Dog Foods, even though it should have worked just fine. Um, I've used those coupons before and not had an issue, but he did just manually enter the $1.50 off. So it already took off $12.50 in coupons. Um, so it got us down from $47.78 to $35.28. Now, after sending all this through Ibotta, I did get back $20. So um, basically, if you get back $20.15 from Ibotta for all of these offers, then you're looking at a final cost for, for all of these items uh, as $15.13. So $15.13 is really um, a good bit of savings when you would have paid almost 50 for this stuff. Now, um, keep in mind also, it depends on how you look at it, um, how you paid, all of that. So on mine, I had a $5 Walmart gift card, so I used that, so it takes me from 35 to 30. Okay, then I had $23 in Ibotta money, and I went ahead and cashed that out and put it in my bank account before I shopped today. So $23 was money that I already had for my Ibotta, so, total of $28 pretty much in like, um, oh my gosh, I can't even think, like rebate money that I already had because the $5 gift card was like from Fetch or something. So, anyways, $28 using my uh, rebates that I had and all that from I bought it and Fetch already. So, it was like I paid $7.28 out of my own pocket technically, and then I got back another $20.15 for my Bada. So, um... Really, I got back $12.87 more than what I even spent out of my own pocket. So, like I said, it depends on how you look at it. But either way, if you're starting off and you're wanting to do these offers, um, most of the coupons that I used today, um, some of them were from the July P&G, um, and some of them were from... Um, online. So that was mostly where I got the coupons for these products. So a lot of deals that everyone can do. Some of them, like I said, had no coupons, but still came out with pretty good deals um, after getting our rebates back. So like I said, you know, sometimes I see, you know, all the hauls like, oh, completely free and everything. And yes, sometimes you can get everything completely free. And if I had to look at it in the way of Hey, I used my Ibotta money and my Fetch Rewards money, paid $7.28 out of my own pocket, got back $20 again on Ibotta, then yeah, I would say it was like it was all free for me. But um, like I said, if you're looking at it from a perspective of how much your total was before coupons, after coupons, and then how much you got back on Ibotta, it would have been like $15. But I feel like that's really good because you're getting laundry soap, you're getting personal care products, you're getting a freshener for your house. Some gum if you need that. Um, got some Jello and some snack bars. By the way, these are Axel approved. He just tried one a minute ago, hence the open box, and he really likes them. So I'm excited to try these little cherry pies because those look pretty good. My kids like the um, Sun Belt bars already and the Pringles. Um, this lotion, you know, I'll either keep or donate or something. 
I don't have a lot of lotion in my stockpile. My dogs like these. And then, you know, feminine care products, I said keep or donate. And I'm a little scared to try the Sour Patch um, Kids Chips Ahoy because I don't know how that's going to mix like there or whatever. Oh, well, I noticed it doesn't have chocolate chips. I thought it was going to be like chocolate chips and Sour Patch. I was like, ooh. But maybe it's kind of like like a sugar cookie almost. I don't know. Anyways, we'll let the kids try those and see what they think. Um, and fries can go with dinner one night. So there you have it. That is my I bought a haul. Let me know guys if you found this video helpful. Would you like me to do I bought a hauls more often? Also, would you guys like me to start doing more of those grocery videos again where I was doing like, um, $50 a week budget for a family of four or things like that or like $100 a week or something, you know, just let me know if you'd be interested in doing, um, or me doing more videos like that. Sorry guys, I have been out at Walmart like for so long and then I was sweating bringing in the groceries so I'm tired and I'm gonna sit down and eat a snack and all that so stop. So we will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget if you're not subscribed yet to hit that subscribe button below and hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. So guys, this is my, I bought a haul. So let me know what you thought in the comments. Did you pick up any of these deals or anything? And don't forget if you're not subscribed yet to hit that subscribe button below so you don't miss any of my new videos. And also hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, Bye guys. You can check out more of my videos here. Don't forget to grab your printable list of all of these deals in the description box below, as well as your money-saving apps like Ibotta and Fetch Rewards.